The Type X Robotic Combat Vehicle, or RCV, is an innovative unmanned IFV that has been designed to fulfill the diverse operational needs of armed forces across the globe. Milram Robotics, an Estonian company that provides robotic solutions, is working on this vehicle with aims to decrease the number of soldiers present on the battlefield. The vehicle is designed to perform missions in hazardous environments while keeping warfighters out of danger. The U.S. Army intends to purchase Type X combat vehicles for its mechanized infantry units, with the Unmanned Infantry Fighting Vehicle or IFV expected to replace conventional fighting vehicles. In brief, it was created to fulfill the specifications of the U.S. Army's RCVM program. The Type X can be fitted with a range of equipment, such as a cannon, anti-aircraft system, radar, or mortar. The Type X was demonstrated to certain military forces in June 2020. It was also displayed at the Military Robotics and Autonomous Systems USA Conference 2021. Most recently, the system was presented at IDEX 2023 International Defense Exhibition in Abu Dhabi, United Arab Emirates. Now let's take a look at the Type X RCV in detail. Design and Features The Type X RCV has a contemporary design and various features. It follows a modular design approach with open architecture, allowing it to be adaptable for multiple roles by integrating improved sensors and other components. The vehicle has dimensions of 19.6 feet in length, 9.5 feet in width, and 7.2 feet in height. The Type X RCV has a weight of around 12 tons, which enables quick deployment to combat zones. It will work alongside main battle tanks and mechanized units on the battlefield while decreasing reaction time. Its lightweight design also enables airdropping by parachute or undersling transport using a heavy lift helicopter. This unmanned IFV has a payload capacity of 4.1 tons, a ground clearance of 50 centimeters, and can reach a top speed of 49.7 miles per hour on roads and 31 miles per hour on terrain. It can carry a range of payloads using the same interface to meet different mission requirements. Moreover, it can operate entirely on its own without requiring any human crew, thanks to its sophisticated AI technology and a remote system operator. Mailroom Robotics Intelligent Functions Kit is the key component that enables the vehicle to transform into a self-driving or remote-controlled platform. The platform even supports indirect drive feature, which incorporates predictive elements to allow the remote control of the vehicle at higher speeds. Besides that, the Type-X platform developed by Milram Robotics integrates advanced technologies such as machine tracking, waypoint navigation, and obstacle detection. Some robot algorithms that utilize artificial intelligence are also included. When compared to traditional IFVs, the RCV has a smaller volume and produces less heat, making it less detectable. It can also transport mesh-enabled communication modules to provide wireless communication. To ensure a low through lifecycle cost and logistic footprint, the Type-X is designed with intelligent predictive maintenance combined with a health and usage monitoring system, as well as line replacement unit principle. Additionally, the vehicle uses hybrid powertrain and rubber tracks to decrease lifecycle expenses. Armament The Type X RCV has Stanek 4569 armor and is equipped with various weapon systems. It has the option of being equipped with a Cockerel Protected Weapon Station Generation 2, a lightweight and low-profile remotely operated weapon system that includes a configurable hatch opening. The hatch opening on the weapon station enables quick reloading of the unmanned vehicle from outside. The turret itself enables the crew to adjust the hatch position to three different modes based on mission requirements. The turret includes CCD, thermal, and fused imaging cameras, providing remote observation with a 360 degrees panoramic view. The CPWS Gen 2 can be equipped with various 25mm and 30mm medium caliber guns, including the Northrop Grumman Innovation Systems M240 to 25mm by 137mm Bushmaster can, the 230LF 30mm by 113mm can, or the Nextra 25mm M811. In addition, the CPWS Gen 2 system is capable of being paired with anti-tank missiles such as Alcatan, MNP, Javelin, or Spike missile for enhanced protection. Furthermore, to provide more situational awareness in the battlefield, the Type X RCV, which is being considered for the U.S. Army's RCVN requirement, can feature a 50mm cannon and a drone tethered to the vehicle's system. 
firepower with a multi-canister launcher. The Tight X Combat Vehicle is designed to aid mechanized units and serve as a secondary unit to main battle tanks. In comparison to conventional infantry fighting vehicles, the Type X Combat provides similar or greater firepower and tactical functionality. It can be utilized to identify and attack targets at shorter ranges and provide support from the sides. The Type X Combat significantly improves the survival chances of troops while reducing the risk of casualties by increasing the distance between friendly and enemy units. The Type X equipped with a multi-canister launcher has the capability to incorporate two of U-Vision's existing loitering munition systems, namely the Hero 120 and the Hero 400 EC. It has the capability to be equipped with multiple autocannons. The Hero 120 has an anti-tank warhead and can remain airborne for up to an hour, while the Hero 400 EC is capable of destroying fortified targets and can remain operational for up to two hours. Additionally, a 24.8 miles range communication antenna is fitted on the Type X, which is mounted on a telescopic mast that can rise to improve the operator's control over the system. Control Station The control station of the Type X RCV allows the vehicle to move independently in high-risk areas using GPS-based position control and waypoint navigation. The operator can review real-time information from the onboard sensors at the control station. Additionally, Milram Robotics is currently working on developing features such as Follow Me, Teleoperation, and Swarming for the Type X Combat Vehicle. Propulsion The Type X military vehicle is set to utilize a diesel-electric propulsion mechanism that combines a JP-8 diesel engine with fully charged batteries. This will provide ample power for the vehicle to move efficiently on challenging terrain conditions thanks to its rubber tracks that deliver superior mobility and smoother performance. Moreover, it boasts an impressive range of around 373 miles. Milram Robotics and Kongsberg Defense and Aerospace have carried out its first-ever shooting demonstration using the Type X platform. The initial firing involved Kongsberg's Protector RT-40, which consists of the Bushmaster 30mm cannon and a linkless ammunition handling system. This marks a crucial stage in the company's joint project to create the Nordic Robotic Wingman or NRW, which is a robotic fighting vehicle aimed at fulfilling the requirements of the Nordic and Western European countries, as well as the US. The Nordic Robotic Wingman's goal is to support main battle tanks and infantry fighting vehicles such as the Leopard 2 or CV-90, and it will be equipped with Kongsberg's best and newest protector remote turrets. Milram Robotics claims that the Type X, which is the foundation of the Nordic Robotic Wingman, offers equal or superior firepower and tactical capabilities to a unit that has IFVs and allows mechanized units to penetrate enemy defensive positions with minimal danger to their own troops. It can be equipped with a cannon that can go up to 50mm, anti-tank missiles, and a tethered drone that provides continuous situational awareness. Milram Robotics has previously introduced the thinnest logistic and combat drone, which weighs 1.8 tons and is currently being used by the Estonian and Dutch armies. The company has also developed a civilian version of the Themis called Multiscope, which is available for companies in the fire and rescue, forestry, agricultural, and other industries. The Type X Robotic Combat Vehicle is Milram Robotics' second combat platform. So what do you think about this Type X Robotic Combat Vehicle? Drop your comment below and let us know. That's all for today. Thanks for watching and see you next time with more interesting videos.